Investing in gold ETFs or gold stocks versus physical gold diving into gold investments can feel like a throwback to a more glamorous age, right? There's something classic about the weight of a gold coin in your hand. But let's be real. This is the 21st century and we've got options now, like gold ETFs, exchange-traded funds, and gold stocks. So why opt for these over the physical stuff? Hash hash liquidity. First off, liquidity. Picture this scenario. It's a normal day in Portland, drizzly and gray, and I decide it's time to sell some of my gold investments. If I've got physical gold, that means finding a buyer, haggling over the price, ensuring the gold's authenticity, essentially a hassle. With gold ETFs, I can simply hit sell on my trading platform, and I'm out before my coffee gets cold. Hash hash costs next up, costs. Physical gold comes with some baggage, literally. You need to pay for secure transportation, storage, and insurance. It's kind of like the extra weight you feel when you're lugging around too many books from Powell's City of Books. But with gold ETFs or stocks, these headaches are handled by the fund or company you're invested in. Hash hash diversification. Then there's diversification. If you're buying gold stocks, you're putting your dough into a company that mines or trades gold. Their success isn't just about the price of gold. It's also tied to how well they run their operation. Sure, it's riskier. The pros and cons of any business come into play but hit the jackpot, and you could be sitting pretty. Gold ETFs offer diversification across various assets, spreading the risk thinner than a single sheet of gold leaf. Hash hash convenience. Let's talk convenience. Physical gold needs to be bought, sold, and physically handled. But modern life is about streamlining, right? Instead of dealing with physical transactions, I prefer clicking a button from the comfort of my own home. With streaming rain outside, I'd rather be watching those gold numbers than running around Portland trying to offload bullion. Hash hash the verdict? There's no denying the allure of physical gold, but it feels antiquated for us fast-paced modern investors. Think of gold ETFs and gold stocks as the ebook revolution. They're a new way to engage with something timeless without the bulk. Bottom line, gold ETFs and stocks are about wading into the investment waters with a safety vest on, while physical gold is more of a swan dive into the deep end. Remember, Investing always carries its own set of risks, regardless of the form it takes. But for those of us wanting a slice of the gold rush without the heavyweight champion belt of tangible assets, ETFs and stocks can be a solid choice. 